This is a patient with a recent right inguinal surgery who comes with left lower quadrant pain. And as you scroll downwards, we can see that there are inflammatory changes in the left lower quadrant, and it's really characterized by this somewhat oval appearing mass that's uh, composed of fat containing tissue centrally. There's a hyper attenuating rim to it, there's a little bit of inflammatory change associated with it. It's adjacent to the sigmoid colon, but certainly the inflammatory change doesn't appear to be arising from the sigmoid colon. We can see similar findings on the coronal CT image of this patient, where we see a somewhat oval-shaped mass, fat-containing, hyper-attenuating rim with a little bit of inflammatory change adjacent to the sigmoid colon. Now, this appearance is classic for epiploic appendagitis, and that really occurs when one of the epiploic appendages surrounding the sigmoid colon twists and loses its vascular supply, and there's impaired venous drainage resulting in this inflammation. This is a self-limited condition, and patients usually get better after a few days of taking some uh, NSAIDs for uh, pain control.